Hello and welcome back to a new episode of Europe Universalis 4 as we continue our game with this just shown. So in the previous episode we just integrated the Aztecs, so we have that going for us as you can see here and apparently we can't we need to core this ourselves because they haven't cored it. Damn it. Uh, this one though is and only this one remains. So let's start to core that one. I don't like overextension. I'm also going to converge this culture. And for now I think that is the most that I can do. Well actually I can convert this culture as well. Let's do it. At least in this land I would like to have Shashan culture all over the place. Also we have a couple of missions. One of them is to colonize people right here which will give us access to this continent finally. And this is not a mission, but it's a personal objective. I want to try and get Zapotec. So I'm not sure if I will colonize up here. Just so I can have a... Um, I do think I can colonize there. And this is a good one. Uh, so I do think I will colonize here first. Just so I can get a border with these guys. Start fabricating claims all over the place and whatnot. So, over here, exactly. You guys go there. You are a cog so you can also go there and these yeah these are fine we're losing a tiny little bit of money so I'm going to detach my mercenaries and I'm going to kill them off first and foremost now these guys I will consolidate so like that we are uh, paying 0 0.29 we are losing 0 0.11 so we'll actually m be making a little bit of money so let's get this going when can I annex you? 45, so a, a few more years, alright, that's fine. Accepted culture lost, so we are no longer accepting uh, Navajo as a culture, accepted culture. That's fine because I don't think we have Navajo anymore. Actually, we do in these two. Uh, 75, yeah, sure, what the hell. Let's just go for it. And 100. Actually, I can watch it from uh, culture map mode. Where is culture? Culture. There. Only these are left, and then over here. A hundred. Let's convert the culture. It's kind of a waste, but well, it's most of uh, most of it is an option that I choose to make. Let's move over there. I'm going to start patrolling because I want to try and discover this land right here. There we go. Now these guys have a four level military and I do not remember their armies actually so let's go and take a look. They have 18,000 troops. Their manpower is 15,900. Uh, um, I do not think we have loans. Nope, no loans. Good. I'm going to reduce a bit our army maintenance just so we can get uh, a little bit more gold. I want a, I want a uh, war chest of 300 gold more or less before I declare war upon these guys. These guys have no allies so I will be fighting them alone. So that is good. Let's see if we can discover this one as well. How are our colonies? Moose Cree is actually getting finished. So this is about the time where I go and grab my army from Moose Cree right here. So um yeah you can go to Nimpuk or actually Seneca. You can go to the capital. Um one nineteen of February, right. You can start moving. One more month should be enough. Montserrat we discovered it. Alright, there's another isle right there. And this is a good one as well. Well, do I want to colonize those guys? Those. Indeed I do. This is still the California trade note. And against uh, Cheyenne. 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 Creek. Against Cheyenne. What? Oh, against these guys. I'll accept. So we are fighting against Cheyenne. So right here. Let's go and send these guys up there. Who is fighting, by the way? It's Objiwe. Yep. 
So I will accept and I'll try to vassalize these guys. Hopefully this guy... Well, yeah, probably I won't be able to do that. Colony self-sustaining. There we go. It were There were a couple more months, but it is done now. Let's get uh, the longhouse starting. Tax modifiers. And palisades. Right. There we go. Exceptionally, year benefits over time always. Let's get these guys onto the boats. Send them here. And I'll send my colonizer there already. They will probably attack. Yeah, there we go. And I kind of lost. What? All oh right, my maintenance. <laughs> kind of forgot about my maintenance, didn't I? And they don't recover anymore. So let's get up there to recover a little bit, and then we'll head down there. Ooh, boy, did I forget this. Um, yeah, there is no need for you to go there, honestly. In all honesty, there is no need for you to go there. We There's nothing we can do. Let's get these guys onto the boats and send them there. Uh, ignore them. A revolt in Squamish. Accept peace. Pay Ducats. And there's a revolt down there. No leader. Where do I have my leader? Right here. Uh, this should be more than enough to handle this. Alright, we stopped improving relations with Osage. Uh, June, so before June I will not declare war. Natives are rising, that's fine. And I do have my colonists some Nope, my merchant. Yeah, never mind. I was looking at that and thinking, why does my colonist why isn't my colonist somewhere? Oh well. Fur alright, that's good news. Uh let's try and discover a little bit more. Come on. This is just so I can see where the do these guys have their last I think it's their their last province. Coast of Hawaii, really? Yeah, let's see. Right, so we discovered Curacao. Alright. This is the last one over in this side. It's a good base tax actually. Seven. They have a lot of good base tax provinces. Indeed they do, and they still have a couple more over here. So let's get here. I'll need to blockade this guy. Rather, I'm going to uh, park my, tr my fleet exactly where these guys are before I declare war, and then I'll fight them. Let's start patrolling them. I want to discover this one as well. Then I'll fight them, probably destroy them, and another good base tax province. Okay, this is good. Now, let's see what kind of buildings can we do. Irrigation. Yep, and I'm not going to be building uh, anymore for now. How is my missionary? It's going at it. Still have the missionary strength boosting. A guy. In regards to technology, we are fine, considering we are North American. Right, so conversion successful. Please tell me you're pausing. Nope. Right, so let's convert another one. Squamish. It's this one. Uh, yep, you are done. Let's flip the culture. 
just for completion's sake. <coughs> Now, uh, our treasury is fairly good. We still we are still paying one diplomatic relation per per month. Uh, these guys are allied with me. Mm, how many troops do we have? A lot. Eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-nine thousand troops. Only S, so 29,000 troops, uh, well, more, but, well, 26 for all effects, 26,000 troops, we have 11 transports uh, here, I'm going to take the transports out of here, send them there, uh, you can stop patrolling now, stay there. Right, so let's merge these, I have 14 uh, transport ships. That is correct, right? I have 14. 14 units of transports, 8 units of light ships. Not sure where my light ships are. I have 3 here, 2 here, 3 here. Yeah. Probably. What is our force limit? We can build 3 more ships. I'm going to be building 3 more light ships. One, two, three. Right, and I'm going to start ferrying my troops over over here. This is a wasteland, so I cannot actually put my troops there, but I can put them over here. So let's try and discover this. Nope, not you. My fleet, thank you. Uh, let him stay at home. We have changed the culture. Lovely. Let's start patrolling until we discover this. Hopefully soon. Hopefully. Change the culture. Lovely. And Lique. Awesome. So a seven base tanks. This is another good one to co to to colonize. From now on I will colonize these uh, if I can. I should probably be able to do so. Just so I can lock um, this. Yeah, as you can see I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine provinces to, to colonize over here and then i'll take my time over in the center so that is the plan and i'll have one of my colonies to colonize everywhere else uh, namely here and over here as well uh, this colony is getting there right so you stop patrolling get home please tell me i do have my mains up yes i do So I'm going to easy start. Fer I'm going to start ferrying my troops over there. I'm going to start with my leader. All right. So Nami has changed cultures. Let's get our leader onto the boats and send it over there. Uh, yeah. <coughs> Transport over here, and yeah, maybe they will rise. Nope, they didn't. Good. Let's get another eight. If I move these guys here, will that take attrition? I don't actually. See. Uh, nope, they won't. Good. Eight and n eight. Well, nine and eight. That will be good enough for me. Now three more light ships. Let's get them together. Merge and start patrolling in the California trade note. Now these I should be able to merge. There we go. Now with that one I should also be able if they stay in the same place. There we go. And now there are only these left to merge. Natives are rising. No biggie. This is repairing. Come on. Get together, will you? I don't want to disrupt the, the path. That's why I'm not 
following them. Now they should... There we go. Right, so 11, 11. Right, so we have our trade fleet right there. So let's get these guys onto the boats. Get them here and over there. Changed another culture, lovely. Transport over there. A revolt in Manhattan, of course. And let's head back here and these guys. Well, you are in rail crushing duty. Automatic rebel suppression, there we go. Cree Patriots. Yeah. And 82.7, we were at 82.7. And our missionary, 75. Point, oh, 76% now. Should be able to win, even with the modifier. It's a crossing. There we go. We actually lost a lot of troops. Right, so let's merge this army. I have 17,000 and Zapotec has 17,000 as well. This can be a little bit um, tricky, so let's grab a couple more units, shall we? Namely, mercenary. Yeah, no, let's get these guys. Uh, no, mercenaries. Now I go back and forth. One, two, one, two, one, two, six mercenaries. Eight. Well, 10. What the hell? We'll go for 10. And 10 mercenaries that will help out over there. Now let's grab all of them and send it over here. Uh, enact them. I'll lose one stability. That's fine. And to boost 66, that's not bad. Horse treatment for in Manhattan, correct? Yes, that's our treatment there. 0.5. Inquisitor died. Bummer. Let's see if we have another one. Early prestige. Nope. And I actually don't like to have any of these guys right now. So I guess we'll be making a little bit more money. Well, actually, in this case, we'll be making a little money. Let's get these guys over here. It will take a little bit longer. Let's get these guys onto the boats and send them over here. I'm not going to uh, unload them here. First, they are mercenaries. <coughs> Sorry about that. First, they are mercenaries, so they don't actually. Oh, this is good. And morale of our armies plus 15%. There we go. Uh, first, they are mercenaries, so. The only thing they that they will cost is money. <coughs> huh, sorry. Yeah, this is being cocoa is being produced. Uh, and yep, that's pretty much it. This I'll let one month pass. This should increase. Nope. <coughs> Colonial range. Never mind. I thought it was this one already. Right, so where is the fleet? It's there, so we'll wait for the fleet to be here. Now it is. Uh, diplomacy, declare war. Show superiority, we have a Casa Spelli. No one will join, that's fine. And uh, let's start going at it. We should be able to win this. Yep, there we go. And now we will blo have blockaded, effectively, their entire uh, army. We'll move over here, rather to help out over in this uh, section over here because I want to find their um, I want to find their army first and foremost they should be they should be there 8,000 so they will have more troops but we'll, co we'll completely annihilate these guys so this is scored. The only thing I'm going to be building is the longhouse right now. And 
as promised I will start going at this so first there send the colonist change the culture of canyon lovely uh, we won Battle of Martinique and as promised they have more troops over there uh, Guadeloupe yep and we'll see if we how that battle turns out Manhattan has become a core province we'll follow them there <coughs> I need a good shock there we go we'll follow them over here conversion successful lovely let's convert another one it will take a long time but it will need to be done anyway I think it's in Shumash nope 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 it's this one that I'm co that, I'm co that I am converting I'm going to our treatment there just so I don't have to face rebellions for a little while our fleet is uh, protecting that so we have that going for us um, I'm going to find out what's over here there we go Antiqua nothing else and I'm going to cross over to Korokau <coughs> sorry again and see if I can crush that army uh, they'll pl probably go over there so let's get going then I will carpet siege rather uh, my army is this one this is the um, the mercenary army I'm going to wait with them over here um, rather I'm going to wait with them in St. Kitts to start sieging their capital but I will start detaching sieges and as you can see they have five uh, colonies and well five colonies are good for me because I have ten uh, troops two each should be enough now these guys uh, Guadeloupe, Antigua and Curacao again they actually only retreated there right there we go now they are going to Antigua so let's follow them hopefully we'll be able to annihilate them soon uh, Guadeloupe they're probably going to Martinique right over here touch siege move I'm going to start moving and this will probably be the last there we go and the battle of Curacao is over as well and there we go now um, yeah sure you can go there you can stay here rather uh, you I'm going to give you one month to repair yourself should be more than enough let's go uh, select army yep there we go over there kill them off they actually will arrive in Puerto Rico so they will go over here so this is kind of a bummer I'm going to split these guys in half send half of those guys there how many troops do I have here select army 3000 yep I'm going to have to grab these guys and send them over there uh, sure I accept I don't have legitimacy so that's why I, I accepted that one I don't like this. I'm not seeing if they will attack anywhere. Uh, Siege of St. Kitts. Pop it my pause. Thank you. Dragon Fur. I'm going to move over here. Siege of Guadeloupe is over. I'm going to move over there. And this will hopefully be the last battle that we make. Um, so Zapotec lost one trade ship. And now they are going to Curacao. Yep. So we are going to blockade this port. let's actually see full annexation no and no way that we will be able to get that uh, those guys vassalized we can make them release the Maya which might actually not be a bad idea because this way I'll be able to vassalize them uh, both we are still making money so that is a positive let's see if we can get someone yeah, I don't like inflation reduction right now. I don't think I have inflation. Nope. And well, yearly prestige, revolt risk. Well, let's go for revolt risk. They sh should get. Uh, nope. 
Siege of Antiqua is over. Let's help out. Well, rather, let's go over there and I'll move these guys somewhere else so they don't take attrition, don't so that they don't actually ha be a drain in our manpower. So let's. Well, apparently there's a fight going over there, so we'll go there. Siege of Curacao is over. Let's see how many troops or how many ships we kill. Troops, we annihilated them. And ships, we've captured two. Lovely. Let's go see uh, blockade that province right there. And you will go there to help. And Portugal is here. 99% It's getting to the point where we can uh, make a peace with them I want to kill off that uh, navy there That's one of the reasons I'm still waiting to see if I can capture another ship Yes, I captured two more ships, so that's good And completely annihilated the navy So that's good I'm going to make them release uh, nations Maya even if I don't, even if I can't uh, actually uh, vassalize them through diplomatic means, I will be able to do it uh, sooner or later. I'm going to transfer the trade power, and this will mean that I will have a hundred percent worse, a uh, hundred percent peace deal. So no waste there. I'm going to go for it. There we go. And I'm going to only check one more thing. Pause the game, please. Uh, we have a truce with them, right? Yes, we do. Royal marriage, vassalization, we cannot, because we cannot enter into a royal marriage. That is why we cannot. So I am going to keep my... Uh, I'm not going to keep it. Keep them here. Uh, I'm going to send them... I'm going to keep my mercenaries. Uh, that is granted. I'll leave my mercenaries up there. And uh, these guys will be the next. I cannot uh, let them return like that. I haven't discovered this over here. So that's kind of a bummer. But oh well, so Aruba, that's fine. Trading in Coco, manpower recovery speed, lovely. I like that. I like them, like that a lot. So once the truce has expired, I cannot fabricate claims, but I will declare war anyway against the Maya or the Zapotec. Actually, I can, I can actually offer an alliance if they improve relations with us. Uh, let's put uh, Zapotec as rivals first. Zapotec as rival, right here. This should mean that our relation with the Maya will improve. There we go. So I will offer an alliance. I will declare war for Zapotec and then I'll call Maya to arms. This means that I will be able to vassalize Zapotec and uh, Maya will not accept a call to arms. So I will actually gain a Casas Pele against him. And that will be it. Hopefully Zapotec continues to embargo us. And if it does, uh, we'll still continue to have the Casas Belli. Right now we don't because we are in a truce. And the uh, embargo does not work if you have a truce with anyone. I'm going to wait here for a little while to recover my ships. And hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. It was a fairly straightforward one. We only uh, went to war against the Zapotec. And I uh, laid out our plan for this game we need to colonize this as fast as possible because Portugal is here I've saw a ship so uh, if you did enjoy it please consider giving it a thumbs up it really helps the channel out a lot and I'll see you guys in the next one so until then and do take care and goodbye